Yeah, we're here with uh, Ripton uh, Ilton, aka Ecomos, and he's talking about uh, great times when he started as a young artist, and then some of the pitfalls as a superstar that he had encountered. And it was uh, supposedly alleged rape that he was, he was actually charged for that, right? Oh yeah. Tell us a little bit more about that, how that, that really happened. 2010. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? I was accused of rape and kidnapping Miss Amanda Rogers. Mm. But she arrived at a gig one day before my performance. I had two performances. One on a Friday and one on Saturday night at a place called the Protocol Nightclub in Kill Devil Hill, Kill Devil Hill, North Carolina. Okay, Red Town. Oh, yeah. In lynching, lynching number nine. Mm -hmm. When a white girl lied, lynching time. Mm -hmm. This chick was at, uh, at the front of the stage with a white rat. So because you're a mouse, you bring a rat to Oh, <laughs> yeah, take a cat to catch a rat. Yeah, yeah. But anyway now, yeah. she's there with a rat. Mm -hmm. the, it, she got a guy, escorted her out the club, mm -hmm. brought her back in, and she stationed at the front of the stage. Right. Mm -hmm. Start flirting. Show me her breath. I like her. It's hot, you know what I'm saying? That's okay. Mm -hmm. okay. okay. All right. Backstage now. I start hanging out, smoking the weed. She start touching me up, giving me the jaw, grabbed her ass, fondled her teeth with the breast, and blah, blah, blah. I said, oh, I'm out here, girl. Boom, boom, right there. I tell him, what's up? Free drinks in her. The second leg of the show. You play to 10, you come off 11, mm -hmm. you go 11.30, and you want a mm -hmm. clap. Then, sit down, all the but up here, but beautiful, you know? The bourgeois. Mm -hmm. Then anyway, and I'm there. The show completed. Step back to my hotel. I say, yeah. I like her, a lot of tattoos, tongue pierced. She, 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 look, she look eccentric, pierced and blah, blah, you know? Mm -hmm. I say, okay. She came to my room. She had a six months old pit bull and a mouse in a cage. I said, wow, I like that. So she took all these things to the club? While you were performing? I just One little rap, but it, it was in her car now. Oh, it was in her car, okay. So the show completed. Mm -hmm. So the club is right there. Close to the hotel. And the hotel right there. Okay. It's about okay. two seconds walk. Mm -hmm. And the band house is like half a mile. Mm -hmm. You know, a party animal, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Anyway, and say because I always invited people back to the my, um, club on me uh, backstage. Mm. I'm saying. So anyway, now she come in, start crying. I said, "What's up, Amanda?" She said, "Well, these white boys beat her and held her down with a with cigarette and burn mm. in her in her back, tattoo in her back." Yeah. She also has a tattoo in her back, mark white trash. Wow. But at the time, I never see that. that. that, that, that she that went to the bathroom, take a shower, blah, 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 hang out, mm -hmm. everybody drink, both of it. And we had sex. Boom, boom, boom now. About two hours after, I heard a knocking on the hotel door. She was still here with you? Oh, yeah, in the bed, laying naked, mm -hmm. under the sheet. So, my two friends from Norfolk, North Carolina, mm -hmm. Mr. Um, Five Star, and Mr. Reverend entered the room. First thing she asked for weed, they gave her weed. They said, Mouse, there's no place at the band halls for us to sleep. So they want to bunk with us in the hotel room. Mm. There was a separate bed. Both men slept in the bed. In the morning, at about 7 a.m., the drawers slightly ajar, open. I said, okay. I saw her smoking a cigarette, playing with her pit bull, with the, the uh, maintenance guy who also had a pit bull. And my friend, um, um, five star, a reverend old side, smoked cigarette. Smoking cigarette. She marched inside the room, said, Mouse, take me to the beach. I will drain through that little one night stand. Mm -hmm. I said, I ain't going anywhere. She said, okay. She said, out there. About two or three, about, about 
I want to have the tour van showed up. And said, Mouse, get ready. We're going to break fast. I said, okay. Put in my pants and blah, blah, blah. And then I did my shower. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. I said, okay. I saw a man a rudder. I said, what's it, baby? I got a, a next show tonight. You know? I'm going to put you on the guest list. They come and say, yes, I'm going to I said, okay. I'm going to um, bring a few friends. You know what I'm saying? Because my bad member's going to be some friends too. Bam. I hugged her, kissed her on the cheek, left. You know what I'm saying? My friend said, my mouth, she's eccentric, like tattoos, blah, blah, blah. They said, hi. Went to the, have breakfast, mm. and blah, blah, blah. Now, in the middle of the night, when I went on stage, I was like, the band playing, but the, the situation at this stage, you know, the open door, we are stand outside, looking in front of the hotel, the motel. There are about six or seven bikers coming in, room, and two police cars chasing them. They surrounded my room, wow. inside my room. And he come out, never went on stage at that, that moment. You know what I'm saying? That moment. So I'm waiting. They went to my room, I said, what's going on? Blah, blah. Went on stage, do my tour show, blah, blah. Came out. Marching across the road now. I'm said, and he come out, I said, yes. They said, do you know Amanda Rada? I said, yes. They yeah, said, yeah, she's okay. I said, mouth. They said, you tell put you behind him. I said, what? Wow. Rape and kidnapping. I pissed myself. Wow. That time, dumb. You know what I'm saying? That's what she does. She so, in other words, do you think you were set up then? It's a big set up, experience. big time set up. But now, mm -hmm. I had this label called Eat Me Records where I could bring persons from Jamaica to Europe, mm. America. I brought mm. seven persons from, from Jamaica to America. And you right. my own lady. Mm -hmm. Met this lady named Barbara White Crow. Mm -hmm. A woman who looked classy, but she was trashy. Never know she did trees in prison fraud. Mm -hmm. And she also sentenced a man for six years in prison. Wow. When she had sex with boyfriend and the man murdered him in front of her. But she always go after non-immigrants. You know what I'm saying? Okay. Mm. That's how she entered my life. Mm. And I also left her one day before her charges. Mm. You know what I'm saying? But she duped me, tricked me by saying, Honey, let's start this e out entertainment and let me co-sign. I signed away my life. Wow. So going to Europe and coming back to America to go to court and April and March 12, Mr. Garifagna told her to cancel my visa. Barbara White Crow canceled my visa. Okay, so called the home office. Mm -hmm. Because